All right, so Pain Boy Zogleg wanted me to check out something that I haven't really seen before. This is Warrior Tear, and it's the Augren story. And uh, he left a note underneath here. It said, "Call you, call you mother on the phone and tell her how much she means to you. Love me, Emperor. Love me, Commissar. Love me, Mum." So, I got a feeling this is going to be kind of a sad story, but at the same time, it's going to be all grand. I got a feeling it's going to be a sad story. I don't know, like I don't know why, but. Augrens are really, really naive when it comes to a lot of things. They're really, really simple. They're huge, they're powerful, and they're extremely loyal, but they're very, very simple. Um, they'll charge a, they'll charge nests of machine guns for a shiny, which is basically a metal. Um, and they're ab humans. They're just huge slabs of meat. It's always funny... And when I'm watching Star Wars vs. 40K, when somebody from the Republic thinks that this is a space marine. Yeah. In any case, this is Warrior Tier. I've never seen anything by them before. Let's get into this. They tell me I can't laugh when I hurt people. Or when they try to hurt me and my friends first. So it ain't fair, ain't it? People mm. try to hurt me think I'm stupid. Well, I'm not. My mom always said, that's a brave old win to me who he really is. Hmm. And mama don't lie. No, she don't. Just cause I'm big doesn't mean I'm mean neither. The small ones always a bit spooked by Ogrins. They don't need to be. <coughs> Karma come, come aside <laughs> at least gave me this to talk to. No, I like at least. I'm the only soldier allowed to call that. <laughs> Everyone else had to call him mum. But I'm special. My friend says cause she scared me. No. But it's not. I think it's cause when we had it right once I helped her out. Before home went away forever we used to get lot time off. But I get visit other worlds and meet other people who look like us. We visited a hot dark race called Krieg once. But I stayed on the ship. I don't like how everyone wears their mask. Mm. Can't see their eyes. That way I don't know if they're friendly or not. Everyone was drinking and laughing and joking and being friendly until one of them gas maskers got upset. Him and his boys started fighting with our crew. That ain't fair when there's five of them. I got shot out lot because I got one of them engineers to launch me in the drop pod. <laughs> he said, no, I won't. What will command say? No, it, it's not regulation. I told him I'd squeeze him into a ball if he didn't, and that's, that's what he set me down. Drop pods is fun. <laughs> a lot of people don't like them because it's funny when the ship's shaking. And you can look out the window and see everything getting close really, really, really fast. <laughs> I was laughing even though I was angry about a lease in the fight. Took me 25 minutes to get her. I oh, said I was nearly killed because I crashed in the big house in the drop box. And then I ran in to miss the lease. She had the gas maskers kicking her. I just ran to them and started punching. Me and Lurch. He's a least he's a the best he's the best crew member managed to fight all the gas masters away. It got so bad I had to hit one of them with another one to scare him off. <laughs> one of them was a nice goat fella, something like Oh you you better stop or I'll start shooting at you and I will. And all the maskers stopped trying to fight me and Lurch and the least. I wish she was asleep, but I picked her up, oh. carried her out the building by stepping through a window. She was out. I had to carry him off because he said he broke his ribs and couldn't walk well. I had him on each shoulder, and that's okay, they're lying small. If they had to carry me, they wouldn't be able to stand up. <laughs> but I like at least. I'll have. She's like the only charge person who didn't treat me bad. 
So I'll go and help her. That's what soldiers do, ain't it? Yes. When I was in training to cut men up in charge, I was sent. Soldiers, we are Guardians. And in the Guardian 6764s, that meant something we never retreat. Yes. Something like that. I liked him too, but I ain't seen him in a long time. I think he was at home when it went away. I hope he's okay. They didn't treat me like crap neither. <sighs> His right eyes just uh, scared me sometimes. Anyway, when I got lurch and at least to the lander ship and put him on board, at least said to me, thank you. I think you saved my life back there. I didn't know what to say. Hmm. I seen her snarl before, even though she was all bloody and cut up. We spent three months extra time there with Mrs. East and the general from our ship top to Damascus. At least told me he'd almost start a war with them Greek <laughs> boys because they want me killed. But at least and the general won't give them. And I wouldn't go anyway. Mama always said, you can't have an ogrin who don't want me moved. <laughs> And that's true, his mama can't lie. Nah, she can't. After we left, Craig got orders to never return the lease. She told me stay with her at all times. Stay with her. We left Craig, I followed Mrs. Lease everywhere. She started telling me don't call her ma'am or captain or sergeant, just call her Mrs. Lease. That still looks up sometimes in surprise when I said name. <laughs> he always asking. Why is that big and get to call her name, but I don't? That's, she always says that same thing. The day you carry me a mile on your shoulder after almost starting a war, and you can call me by my name. It's been a long time since, Creed. A lot of things have changed. Yes. A long time, all the crew was sad and angry. At least told me her family had gone and she could never see them again. She always told me that one day her daughter would thank me for saving her, Mom. At least said her daughter wouldn't get the chance to meet no one. Let show me our mission from there oh, was to no, kill wait, something what? called an African, Mom. At least said her daughter wouldn't get the chance to meet no one. Oh, God. Let show me our mission from there was to kill something called an Avenon. <laughs> They must be real evil, like. Yes. So I told the least and everyone, if I seize him, I put him through a wall until he can't move no more. One thing a while ago, we attacked by some space marines in black armor. At least told me it was Avid on soldiers, and we had to kill him or he'd kill us. We lost Lord that day. No. And I was sad for a long time. At least told me it died of here, but I don't want to hear that. Mm -hmm. I had to beat one of them black marines to death with his own helmet, because my ripper ran out of cells. <laughs> After we killed them marines, guy. at least told me that everyone under her command was to be known as Legion's Bane. Legion's Bane. Mm -hmm. I think that's it. Because yes, from is. then on, we purposely went after the Black Legion whenever we could. Nice. One time we got to work with them salamanders. They were nice. One of them. That was a fight. The salamanders we put up nice, friendly for any guys. But well, when you're right with them, oh, they were brutal. Mm -hmm. One of them big salamanders, a big green mountain man called Sergeant Brassus, he blew a hole in a legion soldier the size of me, and I couldn't help but laugh. <laughs> that really made them other black legion really mad. I got in two with them, those quarters. I killed them with my new club, but then I realized that they'd broke my bloody eye out. Oh. I wouldn't mind it having one eye. I was like them patches, but at least said she needed me to serve. Mm. At least it said a few times she wants to go up and see where her home is. But she can't see it. Whatever that means. So I understand why she wants to go. I want to see my mom and sister again. But I can't while they're Black Legion soldiers looking at that people, you know? Mm -hmm. Not on my watch. It's like my mom always said. If there's a bully, 
It's an Ogryn's job to stop them. Now I miss Mama. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, man. That was... <sighs> mm. That was... That was really, really, really good. Oh. 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 All right. So, um... Uh, that hurts my heart. So apparently, um, this is the story of Acadian Ogren, who, um, he doesn't know it, but, uh, God, this is a sad story. There's so much in here to unpack, and it reminds me slightly of Forrest Gump, as Forrest Gump was like 12 feet tall and built out of a brick wall. Um... Ogrens are very, very special <laughs> creatures within 40k. They're app humans. Um, they're deve developmentally, they're very, very mentally young. Um, I don't like to see, like, Ogrens. Ogrens are very childlike. And they're very brutally strong and they'll do anything if you treat them nice so um it's there's so much in this to unpack apparently he got into a fight with kriegers apparently he um absolutely adores a commissar named elise who treats him well and he saved her life from being beaten to death by a bunch of kriegers which is strange to me but at the same time it's not exactly outside the realm of possibility this was an amazing story. This was a great story. Um, well done to them. It hits you right in the feels. Because he doesn't understand certain things that when he... There were certain things in there that he said that he doesn't understand. He just never will understand. But um, you hear him talking and his mother and sister are probably dead. Elise's daughter is most definitely dead. Um, so many bad things have happened. It's it's a sad story, but it's so well done. It's so well done. Just with the, the only the innocence that an ogren could have, telling some of these stories. Um, that was Warrior Tear, and I want to see more requests for them because this was incredible. Um, like and subscribe if you guys haven't already. I'm going to be putting all of Warrior Tears links in the description down below, so go check them out. And uh, those links are going to be right next to my own, including uh, my Patreon, if you guys like to support what I do here. But if you don't want to do the, the Patreon, don't worry about it. Just li leaving a comment does wonders. So anything like that. Besides all that, guys, I hope that you enjoyed this. I know I did. And I'll catch you guys next time. This is really good.